There has been a staggering increase in shootings and homicides in Buffalo throughout 2020. And the Buffalo Police Department says the way to fix this is through community engagement. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Proya shows us how groups like the Buffalo Peacemakers are really trying to make a difference. I want to talk to you guys. I'm about to take the step to clean it up. Another Saturday night, walking the streets as a Buffalo peacemaker. You call me, I'm going to do it for you anyway. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Today is very empty. Everybody's been at home. But the Buffalo peacemakers are out, passing out pandemic kits and making their presence known. All right, how you doing? They see the yellow and they can feel secure and give up information. And we pass it along. You know, we don't hold it back, but we pass it along. All right, y'all good? Yeah. Okay. It all started with Pastor James Giles, who organized the first anti-violence group in the city back in 1996. 26 years ago, me and one of my partners, right, we actually was coming out of prison and really wanted to do something to stop people from going to prison. Uh, so we started like that. About a decade later, several other groups had formed. And in 2007, they came together to form the Buffalo Peacemakers. So we, in a very intentional way, in deliberate way, we would show up wherever the potential for violence is. We'd show up in those spaces, and, and we were strong. And it worked. In 2019, the Buffalo Police Department reported a 24% drop in shootings year to year. BPD says it was because of community engagement, like the work of the peacemakers. We knew most of the families, and we knew most of the kids from our personal work, from our individual organization. So now you out there, you know, when your kids are cutting up, getting ready to do something crazy, but when you call their name, they'll stop. They'll freeze. It's an effort that still continues today. We, we, we out here saving people's lives, um, you know, giving out information like this, stop killing. In Buffalo, Olivia Proya, 7 Eyewitness News.